Yo, yo, it's your boy Truniri. Welcome to a cookie channel. You all know what happens to this channel. It's all about music. It's all about music. What's gonna be happening today on this episode? I'm gonna be showing you how to register yourself as an artist with Risa Online. I'm gonna be showing you a step by step how to register yourself with Risa Online. Don't go anywhere. Don't change the channel. Stay there. You're gonna learn a lot from this video. Let's get to it. Website. So it's risa.org.za. I'll leave a link in the bio to help make this a lot easier for you. And then once you reach this landing page, you click on the top right where it says log in slash register. And then, sorry, got my old details. So you click on register, bottom right to create your own account. You fill in your email address, first name, second name, and then you put in your mobile number. Okay, let me just do the example quick. Shouldn't take too long. And then your mobile number is 3560-9602. And then this will be green when everything is correct so you click on register it will send you an email and then the email will request for you to reset your password I'm not gonna show you my emails because it's my emails and then you'll see uh, okay I can actually show you this is the email and then you click on reset and then once you reset your password you put in the first password you put in the second password I'm not gonna do that because I have already reset and then once you get there you go back to the login uh, I'm gonna show you my other account I created this one earlier and so I don't know if it's gonna work correctly okay okay since you're not already a member you have to register as an artist um, on the online portal you can register as an artist but that won't mean you are a recent member yet so the only way to get your RSRC codes though is to register as an artist or as a company as a company is if you have an independent record label I'm doing this for specifically independent artists maybe in the future I'll do one tutorial for as a company but you click on register as an artist and then it'll pop you down to the RSRC codes would you like to proceed so I'm just gonna say create a new artist if you've already registered with Risa you might want to select artist so I know my stage name is skill music SA see they've already got me over here so but I'm not gonna do that as I want to show you is if you've never registered before so create a new artist and then you type in everything so you can register as an artist or as a group so I'm gonna do this for solo artists so you click on solo your artist software number okay, 3560 that's also my whatsapp number holler at me if you need any help and then the artist telephone I just put myself a number in <laughs> That doesn't help. Wait, three five six zero nine six zero two. There it is. And then stage name will be Skill Music SA. First name, let's put in my name. Last name H A C K U L A. Okay, and then your ID number is your ID number. So I'm just gonna put nine two four three zero. Ba 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 ba. Whatever. That's not my real one. So yeah, nature of business. So I'm just gonna say independent artist or you can just put an artist then over here put in your email address so let's put in um info at skill music sa preferably use the same email you registered with physical address you put your physical address your city so let me just put in one 15 Algoa road whatever city port elizabeth I don't stay there anymore, so it's not a problem. Eastern Cape for the province. So the city is your city, province, and you just fill out everything as it shows you. South Africa is the country. Your postal code you can copy, and then you click on Add Representative. Actually, let me let me actually do one for Anga. Anga the pianist. I literally just came up with a new one right now on the spot other details you don't have to fill in this organization distributing online distributing i personally distribute with distro kit so i can put distro kit in there and then these should probably be correct uh you have to fill in okay let me just fill in my actual details here I'm 
want to fill in my postal address South Africa 603 yeah that's everything right organization so the organization distributing you can put in your stage name but I'm just gonna put uh, I'm just gonna put independent to there you can put independent it doesn't really matter what you're putting here you can see there's no stars so you can leave it open manufacturing cities I do my own so I'm gonna put independent and then you click on add representative no click on just save okay and then this will pop up importance of an irsrc code this is very important it explains to you exactly what an irsrc code what it's meaning and it basically shows you and tells you exactly what you need to do to get going with the irsrc code it's a unique 12 digit number that you have to eventually start populating yourself made up of two letters which is the country i'll explain that once it's once i see it so click on next opponents are paying this tells you why you should be paying for your membership fee and levies direct bearing on the votes that your members these are the two main things so if you're interested in being part of risa then you would pay for the membership fee and the levies i said uh i did pop up a video that show, tells you gives you a few options why you should consider registering with them but i'm not going to go into that in this video and then click on next disclaimer if you're an airco membership you cannot be a membership of risa i'm not a part of airco so it's fine so i've read then click on next just make sure you've read this thoroughly then click on next okay in this part this is the most important part when you want to request your irsrc codes you click on the tick and then you click on next okay and this will pop up the importance again of the irsrc code you click on request once this has sent through the request samra will send you an email confirming this the irsrc first owner code the, those are the codes that you need in order to connect them to your music so i'm not going to click on request because i've already created one before so i'm just going to click on close and i'm going to basically show you what the first owner code looks like oh sorry i hope this doesn't make there see the account is not approved yet so the council has to be approved but it doesn't matter for now if you somehow end up logging out and then want to come back in you just click on request on the dashboard you just click on request and it'll show it'll pop this thing up again click on request rsrc codes and then eventually once the administration at samuel has gone through all this information they will send you a first rsrc code owner code okay i'm not going to do that now I'll click on close because i already created one okay so what does the first owner code look like let me just put it up on the side i don't want you to see all my other emails um i can show you the fake one that's going to be terminated first irsrc give me a few seconds to show to find that email Let's see. Codes. No, wrong email address. once give me a few seconds i should find it very soon as i see Yes, here it is. Yes, this is it. So I did do the dummy process just to see exactly how it is. Because when I registered, they didn't have the portal. But I needed to show, for example, sake, how it goes. What's very important about IRSRC code, it can only be used for an artist. If you use someone else's code, that artist will be getting the money. So please don't steal my IRSRC codes. But this one's going to be terminated anyway. So it doesn't matter. Okay, so the IRSRC code is this. What's very important to understand is the ZA is for South Africa. So your code will always have a ZA in the beginning. The three digits afterwards in this case is ASV is for Skill Music SA. This is not my actual code. This was just to see how the process works now. So I could explain it to you. And then this one is the year of reference. I think this is a mistake. This should be a 19. Well, for this year it's 2020. So this should say 2020 and that's a 20 and then 
these digits at the end are the ones that you change you have to change them manually for each song that you make you have to create your own irsc code so the very first song will be this so i'm going to show you how i set up something similar basically what i'll suggest you do is rig up an excel sheet and then you type in the whole irsc code where the heck is that thing oh yeah so it's z a z a a s v 20 for this year. Okay, let me do it in capital so it's not confusing. Z A A S V 20 for this year. 0031. So Z A A S V 20 four zeros. 20 four zeros. 1. Four zeros. 1. Yes. So this will be the basically you set up a spreadsheet that'll make life a lot easier for you so you never lose the rsrc code rsrc code track name track name and probably like something similar like a online platform link so i'm not going to fill anything here so the first track so in my case the first track on my last ep was i do okay and then this is linked specifically to that track for the next one you have to change the number to a two right at the end so you have to keep on generating your own rsrc code so i like chicken i think was the next track okay and then what you basically do is just you just drag this down to how many songs you think you're gonna release this year i'm gonna get to 30 at least you see so this is the series of irsrc codes you you make up your own spreadsheet and then you just keep on putting in the song names here and then whenever you're registering on your online platforms you just take this copy and paste it into your online platform and that should make life a lot easier for you let me know if you found this useful and i'm going to be saying goodbye yeah yeah Thanks. that was the way how you register yourself with Risa online i'm 100 percent sure that you all learned a lot from this video please hit the thumbs up drop the comments on the comment section and also don't forget to subscribe if you have a friend who's an artist why not plug him with this video so we can get himself or herself registered with risa online please don't forget to subscribe also don't forget to like the video shout out to everybody watching me Thank you for watching.